Um, hello guys, it's your boy here, Isalim. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who haven't subscribed, please do so. I really appreciate it if you subscribe to this channel. Also, for those who didn't turn off the notification, please do so because I'll be posting um, great new videos about different tools, great tools. Yeah, so that's it so on today's video i'm gonna show you how to remove your apple id on your i devices ios device checkmate devices a9 chip to a11 only without password without um erasing your device without booting ram disk without changing serial number this is a completely simple step for you so for those who know that open menu what is open menu it is when you know the passcode of your device but don't know the password of your apple id so if you want to remove it without without password or without erasing your device and also to support it will support um it will support sim so yeah so that's it guys so don't skip any part of this video because this requires um fo a follow-up of steps so let's get into this video as you can see on my screen there i have my iphone 8 on ios 16.5 and here it is my iphone 8 ios 16.5 as you can see i have um i have apple id on my device that's it but i want to remove it without using the apple id's password or without erasing it so first of all what you're gonna do is if you have um any form of password on your device like password fingerprint face id eh? yeah you have to remove it just remove that passcode or face id or fingerprint remove then after removing you must jailbreak your device there are two ways you can do this for those who know the the usb bootable way if you don't know i have made a tutorial about this you can check on my videos and there's this tool called WinRain which offers um, jailbreak without making this be bootable device. So also if you need this tool, I'll provide the link in the description below. So yeah, as you can see that's WinRain which is version 2.0. So I don't know why but when I open WinRain, my 3U tools automatically crashes so yeah so but all you can see is we need to jailbreak our device and here as you can see it has read the device iphone 8 so you may choose rootful or rootless but it's a simple step just choose rootless then after that just click next so you're gonna read the warning before continuing just read the warning as you can see i told you remove any passcode face id or touch id Additionally, if your device is an 11, that's also just read and follow up the steps. So just click OK. If you have done that, then the device will automatically enter into recovery mode. And our device is now into recovery mode. As you can see, there's guide on how to enter our device in the view. We must enter our device into the view. When you are ready just follow up the guide and just click start okay start okay our device has entered into the view and now it's been jailbroken. broken and the process is going through And it has booted as you can see the check ring logo and those i think it's ram disk i don't know and here it says all done 
the jailbreak has the device has been jailbroken. Yeah, our device has now successfully been jailbroken. So, as you can see, there's Palarain over here. Palarain, as you can see, and just click done. Just close this, and I should open three U tools. And as you can see, the jailbroken status it says yes, it has been jailbroken. So after that, I'll show you that again. I have my my Apple ID is in there, as you can see. So now we need to remove it. So after that, we'll need to open broke RAM disk. Also, if you need the tool of the, uh, if you need the link of this tool, I'll provide in the link this in the description below. So after opening it, just go to options. Then as you can see, there's many options over there. So what you must tick is this one. Just check the remove Apple ID. So I'll just remove, then go back. So also I forgot you need to register your device. So it's completely free. So you'll just see like register option over there. Check device okay device connected successfully so if your device is not registered you see a register option but i have registered mine so yeah so after that just click start okay click on remove apple id just click on remove apple id removing account you can see Apple ID has been removed and our device is being respringing I don't know rebooting it is rebooting so let's wait okay so when we open our device go to settings as you can see there is no Apple ID as you can see so yeah that's a tool if you want it link in the description below and how to do perform open menu guys and yeah as you can see there's no sign in into Apple store if you want you can sign in it's your choice you can create a new Apple ID if you need to create one it's your choice so that's it guys thank you for watching this video please if you haven't subscribed please do so i'm bringing a lot of new videos of, on different tools different ways so yeah also don't forget to like and share this video don't, if you want to support me by donating link in the description below thank you for watching see you on another video